Hello friends, it's Shilpa. I've got this amazing project that I want to share with you guys. It's an altered Valentine's frame and I've done this for my husband for Valentine's Day and I just think it came out absolutely stunning. Um, I'm going to share with you guys and go through um, the things that I've used. Um, but first off, I just want to say a big thanks to everybody for the videos on YouTube because I do get a lot of my inspiration from all you amazing ladies. So thank you for all your videos that you take your time to do. I absolutely love watching them. And thank you also for all the comments you always leave me. It's just really nice and encouraging and I just read them all and I just love it. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And um, so we'll just go ahead and I'll just show you um, the things that I've used. So first off, for the frame, um, I used... I've got three of these frames. I've, I did a whole video on these a while ago. I bought three of them and what I've just done is literally taken the glass section out of here so there's no glass there and um, completely altered it. So for the frame I've used some really dark brown um, acrylic paint and then I've just gone over with some um, metallic um, stamp pads that I've got. The little tiny, I think they're the memento ones. I'm sure they're the memento ones. And I've just gone and um, kind of brushed the gold and a bronze colour one on it. So it's just come out quite good. And on the light it reflects the gold and the bronze. So um, it's a really good effect. And it just looks really nice and distressed. But not distressed as in like really old but quite luxurious looking. So that's what I've done to the frame. And for the floral display on the corner here, all I've done is I've used one of these massive um, red roses, like the velvet rose that I got from um, this um, closing down stall a while ago. And I did a haul on that as well. So all I've done is just um, glittered it up a bit, not too much, um, just subtle glittering. And I've also used... Um, some wild orchid craft roses here that I used on my Valentine's cards as well. So they're the same size. And I absolutely love these ones. And they're really, really nice quality as well. So it looked really good. And I've also used, um, these are actually from uh, Vintage Treasures. They came in a bouquet. So I've just taken them apart and just used three of those. And these are the artificial um, leaves that came with some of the um, artificial flowers that I got. And I've just stickled them with some um, greenish blue stickles, I can't remember what they were called and here as well I've just used some closed rosebuds there's one there, three there and um, some more leaves here and another three there I think working in odd numbers looks really nice on any project and I've also just stuck some um, fabric um, roses in here as well, the black ones. So I've tried to keep it all in like, like a rich reds and dark browns and blacks. It just looks very romantic, I think. So um, for the corner of the frame, I've used, I don't know whether you can catch it, my light's quite bad in here. So I've used some really nice Prima lace and this really tiny rose trim in black just I've gone round as well so that when you hang it it looks um, complete and not just finished there so that looks really good and I've gone to the top as well and on this corner I've just stamped a little tag and distressed it and it just says I love you which I do I love my husband there he is and um, I've just put some um, prima bling round here as well so I thought that looked really nice and um, in this corner here, I love this. This is actually a broken piece of jewellery. And um, it's really nice and it's really big and it's like really dimensional. It's quite puffy. So all I've done is um, stuck this like, I'll just show you, I'll put it here. Um, this dangly bit of um, another piece of jewellery and I've gone round the frame. So it just looks really good. And then I've just stuck that on there and it's got really beautiful little rhinestones in there as well and again put some more of the um, Prima bling and pearls there so um, the other thing for the main section of it the inside um, the background paper there is from 
this paper pad which is the it's by Kaiser Craft and it's the um, Shanta Youth Collection and there's a really nice paper in here I'm going to share it with you because you can't really see it on the frame it's this one it's beautiful it's like um like a really really pale green with this flocked brown um edge here so it's just a beautiful frame and it's got the tiniest hint of, hint of pink going all the way around so I absolutely love this one and it was the perfect size so I used that and um, then behind the picture I've got some more of um, just some printed brown cardstock and some black which you can't really see now because I have to cover it I was just um, kind of adding on and I just ended up covering it but it doesn't matter because you can still see a bit of distressed um, dark brown cardstock behind that and this is some um, the tiny little rose trims and this was actually from um, my sister a while ago so I ended up using that and I had the same piece in black so I used that and this um, photo I printed it out in black and white because I thought it, look, it looks really nice and then I've just mounted it on some red card and distressed the edges in black and then I've gone round with some um, pearl trim and in the corner here I've just added uh, one of those um, keys from um, the, the big chain that I bought recently so and it's got a little heart in it so that looks really cute and there's some tiny little hearts there as well three of them so I thought that look, looked really cute so all in all I think um, it came out absolutely stunning my husband's not seen it yet I'm just filming this while he's at work so I'm going to give it to him on Valentine's Day and um, with his other presents so I hope he likes it I hope you guys like it and um, another little surprise for everybody I'm going to be doing um, a little kit so um, just one kit to make this exact frame obviously not with our picture and um, that's going to be coming up on my next video so if anybody's interested hop along and check out that video and what comes in the kit and it's not just the frame I'm going to be um, doing a little mini album kit to go with it as well so do check that out if you're interested and I hope you guys like it um, or oh, the little other thing that I missed out was this little dangly bit here um, it's actually really really blingy and it just looks nice when the light hits it and that was um, just off another piece of broken jewellery so that looks really good I think especially when the light hits it, it just sparkles a lot so um, there it is guys my Valentine's altered frame and I absolutely love it and I love you too baby and I hope you like it when I give it to you so thanks for watching guys please leave comments um, and I'll see you then soon bye